Funky D, Funky D, everybody, welcome back once again. Atiku Abubaka, now the matter we want to talk today, and also we will talk about today. 602 Boko Haram terrorists when we say the news they tell us say them pledge allegiance to the Nigerian government in fact right here with this one I not understand them but I don't know whether you could understand the whole situation Yet for me, I know they understand this kind of one. Atiku Abu Bakar Nahen Konde trend yesterday. According to waiting the news they tell us. They tell us say he gets one year, year post when they conduct regarding the most favored person when will become Nigerian next president after this their dead Buhari regime. I don't know how a country when they not get any electoral system, a country when they not get a, a real voting system, a country when we say they know they feel they conduct their own election, a country, when we say their election, now world war, I wonder how then they take the conduct waiting that they conduct online because then they tell us say now online they conducted the polls when they show Atiku Abu Bakar as the leading. Presidential candidate come 2023 among them. The people when they call their names, them plenty, but they're not too plenty. The ones when they see they conducted their own pools with articles own. Number one of them where they talk about na kwankwaso. Number two, na chibuike amichi. Number three, bola amedi tunubu and uh, a lot host of them when we say that they claim to us say po they should say atiku abu but that is online post so ladies and gentlemen then our country will not get any voting system they don't get nothing in Nigeria. Now that they claim that they conduct online polls for Atiku Abu Bakar them and for somebody when one become in 2023. Make sure not forget say Atiku Abu Bakar son don't come and come back saying Papa must not be. If in Papa not be, in Papa no go die when be Atiku Abu Bakar. Now they not tell us the full army people. They won't come tell the whole Nigerian people see Atiku now they come back. Makio they don't tell you see. The no go release that power give any South Tower. In fact, the Po say na bola amede tunubu, aka Jagaban. The two bullion van master say na he come out last on the Po. Say Amechi himself, when Biti Buka Amechi from the South, never really show or indicate interest on the matter. But the Kwan Kwasu done run primaries last year against the same Atiku Abu Bakar under the umbrella of PDP, People Democratic Party. Kwan Kwasu, Atiku Sting win Kwan Kwasu. That, that was then, 2019. Sting win now on this poll. Meaning, say, they won't carry Atiku Abu Bakar, come back and give Nigerian people. Now, nah, not them plan. Yarima don't tell her now. After Yarima come come back, he can't deny. See, not talk like that. See, Ibu no good fit become president. He don't tell now before first time. Not be only him, Babachella one. All of them, including R5. 
on toxic. No Igbo man can be. That is why yesterday I did tell the Indi Igbo in general, anywhere where you there, whether you die America or you die America, your mama, your father, they kill them. You know what stand up. Wherever you do, including the Hanes in Debo, right now, make all of them the queue on this Biafra because on no go see any 2023. Even though say they still take an evil man as VP. Nasty why you now still why you because at the end of the day, evil man there will become handicapped as VP. You now see how the Northerners take do or say banjo. When they call Randa Osebanjo useless in Asura. Today, Osebanjo name, they represent corruption everywhere. Now, how they will come tell us now, saying Atiko Abaka, they won't come bring, come give us. Make us stay remind on that. What thing happened in 2019 before the 2019 election? Make it not be like, see, all of us don't forget. And we don't know what in APC and PDP don't do. Because these two political party brother now one umbrella all of the day. Even the Wayo, where they don't wire us today now, nobody they see Tanko Muhammad. Brother, if you see Tanko Muhammad, they make on a tell and say funky D say where in the I be that one <laughs> I be don't go by coronavirus. Maybe coronavirus don't take Tanko Muhammad because since all these things they happen. Make on watch out. Nobody they see Tanko Mohammed. The last time when we hear about Tanko Mohammed, at the time when they tell us say Tanko Mohammed don't make final decision regarding Atiku Abu Bakar and their Jubril Amino Asunani. Tanko Mohammed is nowhere to be found. We they ask, just as only the same way we ask about. Osebanjo. Now, now only Malami, 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 Malami. Nobody they hear about Una Tanku Muhammad the Sharia Master. The Chief Justice. Oh, nobody they see the Chief Justice of Nigeria. <laughs> Make I raise the alarm if Una never raise the alarm. Where is Tanko Muhammad? Though, if anything happened to that one, thank God. If Corona help us strike that one, thank God. <laughs> okay, maybe we go back to the issue when I want to discuss with Ona before regarding the 2019 peace accord. Remember, say, get one peace accord. When APC, they are Jubri then, and they are Buhari, the person will lead them. To that peace accord. Now, this guy, what do they call him? Abdul Salami Abu Bakar, the goatee master. Now, all these people now then put us where we the one where we did today. Most especially Abdul Salami Abu Bakar no Basanjo. Abu Salami Abu Bakar, where would they talk to the man not the into government? The man is still enjoying full time. 24-7 and then they control Asorok. Hmm? A man will stay in power. Just three months, the man embezzled $9 billion. Abu Salami, Abu Bakar, the former president of Nigeria. That is the man who went hand over to Ona, this guy they call Obasanjo. Now, the peace accord, now, Abu Salami, Abu Bakar, now, all of them, arrange them. This thing, when I don't tell you now, this secret now, could still blow your mind. The peace accord, brother, where they, want, where they go there, go do. Now, the one where they take tell, I think, what I say, after making a side patient, say, but they go do like, say, then they fight to deceive the Nigerian population. But then not the fight, they know what they do. See, after they are Jubril, Matiko Abubaka go come in. Now the thing when they go sign that day, make Atiko Abubaka take a missy, make the Jubril follow them, finish up their four years. These people, brother, they don't get any agenda. So, pause, they come tell us now, say Matiko Abubaka won't come become Nigerian president on top to sell our. 
wealth. On top to sell Nigerian NNPC and other important investments when Nigerian people they manage. Now, I think Wabaka they come. I think we go seal Nigeria with cement. It go seal everybody with cement because in don't tell us say in they come sell. For you, when they present Atiku Wabaka, all of us will they watch. Make we see how Atiku Wabaka won't take become Nigerian president. Or who won't come become Nigerian president. Waiting Atiku Wabaka won't go do there. When enough it do. When it did there before. That is to show you, see, these people that they use your head. What in Atikwa Wuba can one go do when enough feet do when it was a person job? They did before. Old man. Why Nigerian people that they like all this uh, good for nothing men? Criminals. Mahem, our people, they praise. Now, they don't clear to all of us saying that criminals, Nigerian people, they run after. They're not going to change because everybody in that country is criminal. 602 repentance Boko Haram terrorists take out of allegiance. Make we read. Then they tell us now, see, 602 criminal Boko Haram terrorist killers. Anything we won't call them, call them. All of them are full of people. They tell us now, see. On a say they don't release the one where they want when they release some, then they recruit and they put them for army. So if you fit in, say this Boko Haram thing will end today, brother. You they kill your goddamn time. Everything is political in Nigeria. Hmm? The Boko Haram matter, na politics matter, not be any other thing. Defense headquarters has said that 602 repentant Boko Haram members swore oath of allegiance to the federal government of Nigeria. You they hear? Terrorists, they swear oath for allegiance to your federal APC government. But somebody won't, won't do protests. Somebody won't say in one separate in one separation in one day in one Nigeria that they push them up and down because they talk talk. <laughs> somebody will say that Nigeria not a walk. EFCC and DSS they did they push them up and down. APC they did they push them up and down. But the killers, the blood litten idiots when them be the Boko Haram nobody they do them anything now they tell you now see them pledge allegiance to your country to your APC political criminals all right the coordinator defense Media Operation John Enoch disclosed this while giving an update on the armed forces of Nigeria operating between July 9 and July 16 at a new conference Thursday in Abuja. Mr. Enoch, a major general, said the repentant Boko Haram members relinquished their membership of the terrorist group and underwent de-radicalization, rehabilitation, and reintegration programs by Operation Safe Corridor. Una de here. That thing when they, that is why I they tell our people say anything when North Thomas talk see then go do then go do it. Whether you like it or not, then go do it. When they tell us say they want to rehabilitate these people. They want to in, they integrate these people. They want to uh, de-radicalize these people. We this in a, on a, this in a joke. All of them are doing this in a joke. Today, what did happen now? Now, army man, now they tell you, see, these people, these Boko Haram people, when play allegiance to your own government, APC people, see, they don't go through everything. Under, go through the whole program by Operation Safe Heaven. 
dans des cas d'assez d'abri repentance boko haram uh -huh. mais qui de enter our head according to him the ex insurgents who have completed the rr program at malam side camp took the oath before 11 members the reason behind the oath of allegiance is to emphasize their loyalty discipline and obedience to the federal republic of nigeria and thereby making a commitment the implication is that at the end of the program if they committed any offense they stand to fulfill all privileges and will it be liable for offense against the state it is heartwarming to state that operation safe heaven corridor has successfully coordinated the drr program for 882 ex boko haram members including the 280 earlier graduated now you say now this one now boko haram university boko haram University. Now him the record is one. This one now Boko Haram University. They say they don't graduate to Una they here waiting waiting on a government they open mouth they talk. Not be me they open mouth they talk I'm from Canada. Now your government they tell you now see all these people say they give them better better privileges. Hmm? then give them better privileges. Say if they mess up, then go revoke their the privileges where they give to them. For this one, uh, uh, Nigerian Terrorist Training University. Hmm? Nigerian Terrorist Training University. Now me this one. When they for Nigeria, where they tell you now, see, nothing will ever happen. I see, they don't train them. They don't play allegiance. A terrorist brother. Malami, you know they see all this thing. You won't be the justice ministers with a claim. Where do they train terrorists? I don't know. I see one of the fight terrorism. I don't know. I see fight corruption. All these things combined together at the end of the day, brother, now still serious corruption. This will not be looting of money. Where would they talk? For a government to the support, they train, they de radicalize, and they integrate and they disintegrate the Boko Haram people. They aid them, they give them everything where they want. When they don't kill millions of people, Una will come out tomorrow tell us, Ina, eh, they kill 20 people, they get that. We know what is happening. They don't kill millions of Christians. In the north, not only in the north, but south, west, everywhere, it don't kill millions of people. Instead of them to go jail for it, because all of us know waiting supposed to be their own um, punishment. I mean, the Boko Haram people for killing innocent Nigerian people with a bomb and with different things. Today. Now them, the government, they welcome. Tell me now whether not the conflict of interest to be this one. Let me see, criminal will go scot free. Like Magona don't go. I don't tell her. Nigerian government that they trim Boko Haram. That they brag self. You hear what you don't read here. And a lot of that they brag. Now brag they brag they tell. They tell you, say, this is one Nigeria, be careful, though. If you not go now, we'll kill all of them now. Now we be Nigerian army, Boko Haram people. They tell you all this things. That's when they rear cow. One love, everybody.